What's up everybody? It's Stock Picks by Tim and we are dealing with a red market today. We're going to look at Trading View's heat map. I'm also going to look at Bitcoin. We are near a critical level here about to potentially break a support and I also want to look over CleanSpark. And if you haven't seen their immersion miners yet, I've got something to show you. And I also just set up my Discord free to join. We've got some trading bots on there. Definitely check it out. And don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. I put out daily videos and let's go look at Trading View's heat map. And we do have a pretty red day and you know small caps are absolutely getting wrecked today I actually did take advantage of some indie and clean spark bought a little bit of both clean sparks down eight percent indies down six we've also got some of my other favorite names charge point bingo workhorse got a lot of smaller caps definitely down quite a bit today now this isn't very surprising considering how much we have ran you know we're definitely due for a few consolidation days maybe a little bit of a retest a little bit of a retracement just to check some previous levels see if we can start establishing some support so we are definitely overdue to test some lower levels and just see how they hold now i want to show you something real quick with bitcoin and i've mentioned this in a youtube short before but we are at a critical level right now and we may break under it it seems like it's starting but i wouldn't call this a break yet i want to see one candle actually close underneath i want to see one full candle formed underneath this trend line and that could be a good sign that we're pushing further not just a little tap underneath i want to see a full candle a full bar on the outside of this channel now zooming in it does seem like there are some buyers stepping in so you want to definitely watch this keep a close eye on it and remember zooming out we are still in a long-term downtrend very possible if we break this we are continuing down we may test our 20,000. we may test 17,000. but you better believe i will be a strong buyer at that time if it gets there and to clarify you know regardless of what it does in this channel regardless of what it does i still think bitcoin is a great dca but i figured i'd just give you guys kind of where i think the direction is going to go for the short term if we do break this it's very likely we test some lower levels if we're able to hold it we could potentially break out of this downtrend but we will be waiting until you know somewhere around the beginning of september so we are going to have to play the waiting game if we do in fact hold this level and of course with bitcoin falling a bit no surprise that clean spark would fall as well and of course we've got small caps dropping so we've got a lot of things pushing clean spark down today now zooming out a bit you'll see we are still holding this trend we were in this downwards wedge we were in this descending wedge once we broke out of it it tried to hold it tried to see if it could hold this descending trend line here as a support sure enough it did and it bounced now i'd say we are still currently in an uptrend and you want to watch this trend line if we do break from this trend line if we break five dollars i'd say five dollars if we were to break five dollars we'll also be breaking this trend line and we could push lower now it's very possible that we do hold this trend line we do have some previous resistances here that could help us out a bit and we may bounce now of course it's going to depend on what the overall market does and what bitcoin is going to do but i do currently think that clean spark is extremely undervalued regardless of if it goes up or down in the short term i think it's still a great buy now i'll leave you guys a link below to this or you could just find it on their facebook but it's pretty cool it shows their immersion rigs in action and let's check it out Now, really quick, I wanted to go over this article and I'll leave it down below as well, but it's basically nine industry leaders and their ways that they would address crypto's naysayers. And Zach Bradford actually says, showing behind the scenes footage of our mining facilities gives people the chance to see the physical infrastructure that undergrids this technology. While some people may not 100% understand how something operates, that doesn't mean they won't accept the concept. There's still time before Bitcoin and other coins are widely adopted, but adoption grows when we see ourselves as educators. But I'll leave this down below for you because there are some other interesting quotes. But that's it for you today, guys. How are you doing in this red day lately? Have you taken advantage of this red day, added some stocks, or do you think we're falling from here? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks as always, guys, and take it easy.